So my name is Inga Mewburn and I'm the Director of Research Training at the Australian National University. I really get into the nerdery of it. So I really enjoy analysis the most and I hate writing literature reviews. So give me a spreadsheet full of data, I'm a happy camper. But um, reading piles and piles of journal articles, not really my thing. Am I a global researcher? I don't know. Um, I just like collaborating with people that I get on with, really. So I look for people that I have very similar interests with and people whose company I enjoy. So I don't really think about it as global or local. It's more who's into what I'm into and interested in the same questions. As a global teacher, that's a different proposition, going around and doing different teaching in different countries. The jokes fall flat some places. They work in other places. Um, and I've really learned a lot about how different cultures are um, in all the travel I've done, which is quite a lot since I started the blog. The most challenging thing in my career so far, the most challenging thing would be the structure of academia itself. It's very hard to get into it. It's very hard to break into getting a job. And I did oh, around about 11 years of casual lecturing. And sometimes I was only on six week contracts. And um, that's when I really built up my, my network of people, my network of contacts, because that was the only way I was going to get the next job. They were really hard times, actually. Um, so that's what I found most challenging, not the work itself, not the people, it's just the structure of the workforce and how casualised it's become. Very difficult to navigate. You need all sorts of literacies I didn't realise that I needed um, and that I've learnt along the way. The most enlightening thing would have probably been just discovering social media for me. Um, and discovering those few people in the world that really get into the same things you do, that are hanging out there. They're not in the next office from you. They're across the world and being able to talk to them uh, is so different even from when I started as an academic in 2000. To just be able to have that network of international conversations has been, it's really changed my life in the last five years, I think. Um, and I'm surprised at people not jumping on that and seeing the pleasure and fun that that can bring.